So hello, and thank you for joining us today for today's Public Good App House demo event. So joining me today, we have Kat Murphy-Toms, the Director of Digital Strategy at Giving Tuesday. Giving Tuesday leverages social media and a broad network to ignite a movement and global call to action to give. Kat studies the use of digital tools and social movements, particularly their use in shifting power, creating mass mobilization, and achieving global equity. Thank you all for taking the time to be with us today. Thank you to TechSoup for having me. Uh, we are less than two weeks to go before uh, Giving Tuesday happens to us all, whether we're ready for it or not. So I'm hoping to give you all a little bit of background about where we've been, where we're going, and what we've learned uh, throughout these 10 years now of Giving Tuesday. And the reason that we know all of this stuff is because of the data. As you all likely know by now, Giving Tuesday was created in 2012. Uh, it was a really simple idea. Could we create a day after a bunch of days of consumerism? Could we create a day that was all about the opposite, about flipping that on its head? And could we create a day that celebrated generosity uh, and a day that encouraged people to do good? And it turns out that you could. Over the nine years, uh, well, 10 years now that Giving Tuesday has been happening, this is the 10th one, I can't even believe it. Uh, this idea has grown into a year-round global movement that inspires millions of people to use the power that they have within themselves to give, to collaborate, to innovate, uh, and celebrate all types of generosity. Uh, it, it spanned the globe. We started here in the United States, and we are now have Giving Tuesday leaders in over 80 nations. There's Giving Tuesday activity that we are able to track via social listening tools and all of the data that's provided by our data uh, providers. There's activity that happens on every single uh, territory, nation, country, every corner of the Earth, literally, including space. We're intergalactic now. An astronaut tweeted uh, last year. It was the best thing that ever happened to us. Uh, but there's 80 of these nations have a leader, a hand raiser who organizes Giving Tuesday in their nation. In 2012, everyday givers, average people in the United States gave a whopping 2.47 billion, almost two and a half billion with a B dollars in 24 hours to social good. Uh, we're, every year we're astounded by this number, but we pretty sure we know the reason for why that is. People don't just give money uh, on Giving Tuesday. This is, and we welcome that. This is an opportunity to celebrate all types of giving. And we believe that every single act of generosity is one that's gonna move our society forward. And is, it's these little actions that come together that are really gonna change the world. So people volunteer on Giving Tuesday. They give their voice by posting on social media for different advocacy efforts. Uh, they give goods, they give in kind, they give in every single way that you can can imagine and we are so thrilled about that and we find that it's our mandate to measure that we'll talk about that in a few minutes uh, so one of the things that we've learned from this is that you really want to offer as many on ramps into your organization as, as you're able to people want agency to affect change in the way that they're able to in the way that they want to and so you want to offer not just on giving tuesday in general you want to offer as many ways for folks to tap into your mission uh, and get involved. Our mandate, as I said, as Giving Tuesday, the organization who runs Giving Tuesday, the movement, which are two kind of separate things, uh, we find that our mandate is to measure the Giving Tuesday effect, the generosity effect, the mass mobilization that happens on Giving Tuesday so that we can learn how to leverage this uh, to propel even more generosity later on and throughout the year. So we established the Giving Tuesday Data Commons. This is the largest philanthropic data collaborative of all time. Uh, all of our panelists are members of the Data Collaborative. There are 70, I think we're up to 100 now, data providers. These are donation platforms, giving portals, you name it, um, the, the visas and MasterCards of the world. Everyone collaborates and comes together uh, to share their data. We think that this sharing uh, is what's going to move our sector forward in times where we need to be really resilient and really, really innovative. When we share our data uh, and analyze giving data and trends, we're, we're going to be able to move ourselves forward. Some of the things that we've learned about Giving Tuesday through our data collaborative and other work, uh, 
84% of people, most people that participate in Giving Tuesday say that it inspires them to be more giving throughout the year. 52% of people who participate in Giving Tuesday by donating, they say that they do that because they feel like they're part of a bigger group. And that's not surprising to us at all. People find tremendous joy in giving. And when something brings you that amount of joy, you want to do it again, right? So my advice to each and every one of you, including our, our panelists here, is to create solutions and, and, and apps and opportunities and experiences, because that's what you're doing. You're taking your supporters through an experience. Create joy. The actual mission of Giving Tuesday, the organization, is to reimagine a world that's based on radical generosity. The notion that someone else's suffering should be as intolerable to, to us as our own suffering. And we believe that if people flex their generosity muscles regularly to create a habit out of giving, that they're going to be much more inclined to other pro-social behaviors later on and throughout the year. Everything from civic engagement to voter registration to activism to local community organizing. And that that kind of generosity is going to provide the key to a healthy civil society. So if it's one thing that I want to leave you with today, it's that the Giving Tuesday movement gives us an opportunity to build the world that we imagine to be possible. It's innovative hand raisers like you. It's innovative hand raisers like our panelists, who I'm so excited to hear about. Uh, and each and every one of you as nonprofit and social good organizations uh, to do the work that you're doing, to be innovative, to be creative, to create moments of joy uh, for your supporters who are going to make this possible. So I want to thank each and every one of you for being here, for being part of the Giving Tuesday movement. And we'll see you in a few short days uh, as Giving Tuesday descends upon us. So thank you so much. I appreciate every single one of you and we'll see you soon. Mm -hmm.